Hey, it's Jerry. I'm here for the Makeup Heroes, and I'm doing my Upside Down Smokey Eye. Basically, we are all recreating a look that uh, Marlena from Makeup Geek TV posted uh, called the Upside Down Smokey Eye, and putting our own spin on it and seeing how we adjust it to fit our eye shape and our skin tone and how we prefer to do our makeup and whatnot. Um, in the original video, she used a peachy pink gold duochrome shade on the lid, nothing in the crease, and then a gunmetal shade on the lower lash line with a tiny bit of bronze to blend it out, then just liner and mascara. But when I watched the video, I was like, this is going to look disgusting on me if I follow it step by step, so I knew I'd have to change it a lot to suit my eye shape. Um, and yeah, in the video she used nothing in the crease, but I thought, if I don't do anything in the crease, I'm going to look like a mutant. I have quite small lids and a fair bit of crease to brow space, and if I don't put anything in the crease, or if I have a substantially lighter colour in the crease than my lid, I look like an alien. It makes my lids look even smaller, it makes my crease look like it ends halfway up my forehead, and it's just so unpleasant looking. So I added a fair bit of matte brown contouring in the crease. And then I didn't quite have anything like the peachy pink gold shade she used on the lid, so I mixed a bunch of colours and I ended up with kind of a chunky glitter look. I hated it when I was doing my makeup. When I was doing this look, I was like, that's disgusting, I do not like this. But I went with it anyway, and I ended up, I really kind of like how it contrasts with the matte crease. Um, and then gun metal on the lower lash line. I want to love gun metals, I really do, but they don't love me back. They either turn black on me or they turn blue on me. And then it's like, well, what was the point of that? I could have just used a black or a blue eyeshadow. Um, thankfully, it turned black on me today because when it turns blue, it looks rank. It looks so disgusting. It makes me look sick. It makes me look even more yellow and it's just generally unpleasant. Um, but thankfully, it turned black on me today. And she took the gunmetal slash black further in on the lower lash line than I did, but I thought that if I did what she did and put black on the waterline as well, that was going to make my eyes look like they'd receded back into my head and just disappeared completely. So I had to add a little pop of silver on the lower lash line to open up my eyes a bit. And then I lined um, both waterlines with black and added mascara. I hope you enjoyed seeing my version of the Upside Down Smokey Eye. Make sure to check out the original video and the other Makeup Heroes videos because I think it's really interesting to see how we can all take one look and just have completely different spins on it based on our eye shape and how we prefer to do our makeup and colours that suit our skin tone and whatnot. So I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you for my next video. Bye!